So today is Shrimp Chow Mein Day here on Realize Guyana. Welcome to our channel once again guys. Thank you for being here. If it's your first time, please hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you are notified whenever we post new videos. You won't miss any. So today we are making one of Guyana's national dishes. And I tell my friends that if you go to a Guyanese function and you don't see fried rice and chow mein, then you're in the wrong place. You better get out of there before you get beat up. Fried rice and chow mein is the most popular dishes at every Guyanese function. So today we're going to make another variety of chow mein for you guys. There are so many varieties. And we're going to be doing a shrimp chow mein today. Yummy, delicious shrimp chow mein. So for this here we're going to be using our favorite champion chow mein as you can see there. We're going to be using some kazrip of course. Black pepper. So we're going to be using some bell peppers also to give some color to the dish. We're going to be using some scallions, carrots, onions, celery, some black pepper and chow mein seasoning as well. And we have our shrimp of course there which we're going to be using guys. So that's everything we're going to be needing for this yummy delicious Guyanese shrimp chow mein. So let's begin guys. So we've put our water to boil and we're going to add our chow mein now. So you're going to bring it up as usual. Now we're just going to add a bit of salt to boil this. So this is the way you want to cut your carrots. So this way of cutting has a fancy name called julienne. Julienne your vegetables. So these are big peppers we had here and we only used half of each pepper. So in the meantime our chow mein is boiling away. So let's check this chow mein and show you guys. So it still needs a little bit more. So I think we can get a shrimp ready by the time the chow mein is ready. So let's see. Alright guys, so this shrimp that we have here, they were already deveined, so that's going to save us a lot of work here. And you're going to be having a restaurant quality chow mein here today guys. You're going to learn how to make that right here in Real Nice Guyana with this yummy looking shrimp. i give my chow mein another turn here. So we are using for this chow mein here today, we are using 400 grams of shrimp which is equal to about 3 quarter pounds. But you can use less than this, you don't have to use this much. So our noodles is done now. And this is how soft we boil ours. So 
So in the case of the noodles guys, you want to, once you strain your noodle, you want to run some cold water on it to prevent further cooking. Because that heat in there, that's what can ruin your chow mein and make it too soft. So as I was saying guys, once you strain your chow mein, sometimes you leave it there and you get carried away, you start doing other things and then it sits there for a while and there's a lot of heat in this chow mein. As you can imagine, it's compact there. And that's what causes it to get soft or you see, at the end you say, oh, I don't know how this chow mein got so soft. That's the reason why. So you need to run some cold water in it to stop the cooking process. So we've got everything ready. We've boiled our chow mein. So now we've heated some oil and we gotta continue. That's our chopped onions. So you wanna fry your onions at the beginning until it gets a bit translucent, a bit brown in color. And that adds a really nice flavor to your dish. Okay, so that's enough. So we're gonna add our carrots now. So in goes our peppers. And you see how pretty that is looking already? So once you add your peppers here, you want to cook this a bit until it cooks a little because you don't want, once you add your chow mein and your shrimp and you, you're done, this is still crunchy. You don't want that. So just make sure this cooks properly. So now we're going to add our shrimp. Salt to taste. Black pepper. So as you see, we've added the shrimp towards the end when this is almost done. The shrimp doesn't take long to cook. And now the shrimp is going to infuse with all those wonderful flavors of the onions, peppers, and that's all about making a nice dish, building flavors as you go. Alright, so about two minutes after you add your shrimp, you're now going to add your scallions and your celery along with your pepper if you're using. We are using one very, very pepper in this dish. And if you're not accustomed to hot peppers, the very, very pepper is going to be hot for you. It's, it's not as hot as, as touch bonnet pepper, but it's very hot also. And that's it guys. So now we're going to add our chow mein. So our stove is cooled off guys, so we're back here. And we're going to continue the rest of our mixing here. And have some kasarip. So you can add as much kasarip as you want to give it a color you, you like. You would like a darker color. Some people do. So look at that guys, our shrimp chow mein is ready and doesn't that look delicious, delicious. So that's it for this recipe guys, our shrimp chow mein. If you like this video please remember to give it a thumbs up, it helps our channel. If you haven't subscribed please do, please click the notification bell also so you will be notified whenever we post new videos, you won't miss any. Please share this video also and as always thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.